Hello and welcome to Kodo Cap Mets. The Mets retiring the legendary captain Keith Hernandez is number 17. For the rest of Mets eternity, no other player will ever wear that number. Great honor and a beautiful day at City Field. A well done celebration followed by a very interesting game with the Marlins. The Mets are going to give up a couple of leads and make some real Metsy plays, but in the end, karma is going to work out as the Marlins are going to give it right back. One fundamentally sound play that Keith Hernandez would really appreciate is the amazing relay throw by Louis Guillaume on this base hit. Uh, Nimmo over in the gap, cuts it off. It's clearly going to score two runs, except it isn't. Louis Guillaume, combined with Sanchez's horrible read as a base runner, is going to create an incredible out at the dish to keep the game tied. But James McCann is injured on the play. Nito comes in as a new catcher to catch a new pitcher, Lugo, and he gets the express, and he was not looking for the heater. This goes off the brick wall at City Field. A complete Metsy play as the wild pitch creates... A deficit. Mets are going to get two runs back. Lindor hits a bomb to give them the lead, but Aguilar is going to hit a game-tying homer off of Ottavino, and that's going to lead to the tie game in the 10th, where Lindor is going to make a great diving stop, and then an incredible Metsy decision to throw to an empty vacated base to get a guy that he probably wouldn't have gotten anyway. Again, a Marlins base runner gets a bad read. Billy Hamilton going back to the base hesitated before leaving. But even so, I don't think Lindor gets him. And of course, Escobar was setting up to take the cutoff throw. Miraculously, Nito is going to pick off Birdie at second. Mets are going to get out of the inning only giving up one run. And with the ghost runner at second after two consecutive strikeouts Nito jumps on the first pitch and the Mets are alive off the glove down the line the Marlins start giving back some gifts and that leads to the ultimate gift Nimmo's comebacker turns into a walk-off error really ironic that Keith Hernandez known for his defense and clutch hitting and the Mets walk it off on an error but they'll take it Keith Hernandez Day will always be remembered as a victory, and the Mets hold the Braves off another day. They keep the lead at two and a half games as they get ready for their big showdown Monday. Mets win. Keith Hernandez number retired. The Mets are 7-0 in that strandings, and none more bizarre than this one. They gave the Marlins a run on an error in the top of the 10th, and they win it on an error in the bottom of the 10th. If you like this video and you love the Mets, please subscribe. And then we'll sing. Let's go Mets! <laughs>